All right, guys, in this video, I'm gonna break down quick ROI method number two, which revolves all around CPA, cost per action type offers, and specifically content locking. Okay, so this method mostly applies to the first type of niches that we went over, uh, like watch movies online, watch TV shows, sports, video game cheats, video game hacks, all of those kinds of niches and those types of keywords. And you'll see why in just a second. So basically the method goes like this. You rank for one of those terms. So let's say watch movie title online. And what we're gonna do here is rank some kind of PDF or document. So let's say we rank a Google doc about this movie. Then at the beginning, you know, we just have a big link uh, at the top of the PDF or whatever that looks something like this. Uh, watch movie title, movie title here. And you just have a link like this at the top of your PDF. Make that blue. Boom, just like that, right? So you have a link um, at the top of the PDF. Say so you can watch the movie here. So. That's how you take the traffic from the PDF, the authority site, to your main site. So here this link would be going to one of our sites where we can content lock and, well, make money off of the ranking. Right, so once they go over to the site, we might have a site that looks something like this. Now this is in French, uh, just one of our examples here, but ignore that. You don't really need to see it. This is for a video game cheat, so they click uh, Telecharger, which I believe means download. Uh, and then they select one of the three cards here. And then they click download again. But before they can download it, and yours does not have to be this complex, by the way. This is a really good one, uh, but you could keep it really, really simple. So basically, let's say you take them to a website where they can watch this movie, and then they click watch, and a pop-up comes up saying you need to complete one of the offers below to continue. So these are all CPA offers here. And when they fill this out, you get paid, right? You get paid per lead, per action. So if I click on one of these here, get a $50 Taco Bell gift card, you'll see that this is just a pretty general CPA offer. And when they complete this, we get paid. Okay, so the traffic goes to your authority style site. They wanna watch this movie online. Then they hit your Google document about the movie. They see this link here, watch movie title online. This goes to a simple little site that you may have set up where they have to complete a CPA offer to continue. And that's when you get paid. And you don't have to put anything on the other side. I know it's a sneaky little trick, but they shouldn't be, able, they shouldn't be trying to watch these movies online for free anyways, right? But it's just a quick way to get uh, an ROI on your ranking. So if you wanna use this method, you could get a content locker here. Uh, there are different types of content lockers that you can buy. You can just Google content locker, or you could just set up a simple little pop-up on Optimize Press that says fill out one of the offers below to continue or whatever. You don't really need content locker. You could just make one yourself. So the idea of content locking and using CPA offers with authority snap is you find something that someone wants right away, like a video game cheat or the ability to watch a movie online, and you make them fill out an offer, a CPA offer in exchange. Uh, and you get paid whenever one of those actions is completed. So really a simple method um, if you don't want to set up one of these sites, no worries. There are plenty of, other, plenty of other methods that you can use, or you could just put an affiliate offer right in the PDF. You could just skip this entire step and <clears throat> put an affiliate link right inside your PDF, so that way you don't have to build a separate site to send traffic to. This is a method that we use because it works really well, and we can get a lot of traffic from our authority rankings to our main site. So that's pretty much all for CPA and content locking.